They missed Hartenstein on the lob, but have him on the mismatch. Deep three by Kennard, and he knocks it down. Luke Kennard came into this game 11 of his last 15 from distance and knocks down the triple there. Against the Lakers. Luke stepping back, and I mean stepping way back. That was the green ball on All-Star Weekend. 28-25, Clippers out in front, 9.44 to play here in the second quarter. Kennard gets free for a moment, that's all he needs, and knocks down his second three. Lakers just 10 for 30, that is not necessarily bad news considering they are only down by six. Kennard another three, I tell you what, he could throw a key into a lock. Luke Kennard is three for three. Kennard getting a little chuckle right now because he knows how hot he is, he knows the basket looks big as a lake out. I don't know when I've seen Dwight Howard look this good. It's been a long time. Reggie, tricky pass to Kennard. Gets around his defender. The floater for Kennard is good. Inside, outside, it's all good. Worth pointing out, the Lakers are very good when trailing by double figures as the Clippers get the stop ahead to man to the cup, and he punches it in. Timeout, Lakers, 46 to 33. Wondering, could he see him out there? All of a sudden, last second, Kennard looks up, pitches ahead, man. Reggie to man in the corner. Another good look for Kennard. It's good for Luke Kennard, 56 to 42. We need to give the Laker defense a little bit of credit. Luke teeing it up. And you talk about credit, that is a missed assignment there from the hottest shooter in the league. Well, in transition, Luke filling in the open spot. You mentioned that Lakers have a breakdown. Luke makes some pay. Clippers had a cold quarter, shot 29%, one for eight from three-point land. Give and go, Hartenstein gets pushed. It wouldn't fall. He'll go to the line, though, for two. College Knights. I think we just may have had a technical on Carmelo Anthony, so Luke Bernard goes to the line, knocks that down, the technical foul. Make Anthony put the ball down on the floor. He's in the groove right now. He's hit two three-pointers in a row. Take him out of that comfort zone. Kennard has been quiet in the second half. Hartenstein, the floater is good. Mentioned the early foul trouble for the Clippers in this quarter. The Lakers just did not take advantage of it.